up guys welcome back to another video we are playing welcome back to an episode of Detroit Become Human last time we had Connor well we had we had a uh, actually we had a uh, Kara while she while she was while we were in the hotel and then then um what the heck is this place? Find a zombie what the heck? And Marcus, we got out the junkyard, so let's do this. Find Amanda. Who's Amanda? This Amanda? Hello, Amanda. Oh. Connor, it's good to see you. Finding that deviant was far from easy. You showed great skill in your investigation. But you knew deviants could be unstable. You should have been more cautious. I thought I could make it talk. It was a judgment error. Never mind. I'm sure you'll be more careful in the future. The interrogation seemed... challenging. What did you think of the Deviant? It showed signs of PTSD after being abused by its owner. As if its original program had been completely replaced by new instructions. This Lieutenant Anderson has been officially assigned to the deviancy case. What do you make of him? He's obviously not what I was expecting. But I don't have enough information yet to form a definitive opinion. Unfortunately, we have no choice but to work with him. What do you think is the best approach? I will try to establish a friendly relationship. If I can get him to trust me, it will be helpful for the investigation. More and more androids show signs of deviancy. There are millions in circulation. If they become unstable, the consequences will be disastrous. You're the most advanced prototype Cyberlife has ever created. If anyone can figure out what's happening, it's you. You can count on me, Amanda. Hurry, Connor. There's little time. Get your, get your main arsenals out of here. Can I help you? I'm here to see Lieutenant Anderson. Do you have authorization? Yes. <laughs> Lieutenant Anderson hasn't arrived yet, but you can wait at his desk. Excuse me. Do you know what time Lieutenant Anderson usually arrives? Depends on where he was the night before. If we're lucky, we'll see him before noon. Thanks. Exp 
the lower new office. Damn. That's what the heck am I holding? Okay, so first. Call Hank Anderson. Hi, this is Hank. Not here at the moment. You can leave a message if that's what turns you on, but don't expect me to call back. Beep. Whatever. Lieutenant Anderson, this is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. It's almost noon, and I'm waiting for you at the office. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. Oh, good cop. Good cop. Real police. Nice guy. Asshole. It's good to see you again, Lieutenant. Oh, Jesus. Hank! In my office! I've got ten new cases involving androids on my desk every day. We've always had isolated incidents. Old ladies losing their android maids and that kind of crap. But now, we're getting reports of assaults and even homicide, like that guy last night. This isn't just Cyberlife's problem anymore. It's now a criminal investigation, and we've got to deal with it before the shit hits the fan. I want you to investigate these cases and see if there's any link. Why me? Why do I got to be the one to deal with this shit? I am the least qualified cop in the country to handle this case. I know jack shit about androids, Jeffrey. I can barely change the settings on my own phone. Everybody's overloaded. I think you're perfectly qualified for this type of investigation. Bullshit! The truth is, nobody wants to investigate these fucking androids, and you let me hold in the bag. Cyberlife sent over this android to help with the investigation. It's a state-of-the-art prototype. It'll act as your partner. No fucking way! I don't need a partner, and certainly not this plastic prick. Hank, you are seriously starting to piss me off. You are a police lieutenant. You are supposed to do what I say and shut your goddamn mouth. You know what my goddamn mouth has to say to you? Okay. Huh? Okay. I'll pretend like I didn't hear that. So I don't have to add any more pages to your disciplinary folder, because it already looks like a fucking novel. This conversation is over. Jeffrey, Jesus Christ, why are you doing this to me? You know how much I hate these fucking things. Why are you doing this to me? Listen. I've had just about enough of your bitching. 
Either you do your job or you hand in your badge. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got work to do. I wonder whether Lieutenant Anderson is really the best person for this investigation. Hey, I don't need a machine to tell me how to handle my men, okay? So get the fuck out of my office. Have a nice day, Captain. I get the impression my presence causes you some inconvenience, Lieutenant. I'd like you to know I'm very sorry about that. Says now that we're partners, it would be great to get to know each other better. Maybe they're trying out a new form of red ice. In any really case, the forensics. I'd like you to know I'm very happy to be working with you. I'm sure we'll make a great team. Is there a desk anywhere I could use? No one's using that one. You're a Detroit Gears fan, right? Denton Carter scored 53% of his shots from the three-point line yesterday. Did you see the game? That's what I was watching at the bar last night. Oh. Do you listen to Knights of the Black Death? I really like that music. It's full of energy. You listen to heavy metal? Well, I don't really listen to music as such, but I'd like to. You have a dog, right? How do you know that? The dog hair's on your chair. I like dogs. What's your dog's name? What's it to you? Sumo. I call him Sumo. Have you known Captain Fowler for long? Yeah, too long. A lot of people don't appreciate having androids around. I was wondering, is there any reason in particular you despise me? Yeah, there is one. If you have any files on Deviants, I'd like to take a look at them. Terminal's on your desk. Back yourself out. Forty-three files. First dates back nine months. It all started in Detroit and quickly spread across the country. An AX-400 is reported to have murdered a man last night. That could be a good starting point for our investigation. I understand you're facing personal issues, Lieutenant. 
but you need to move past them. And hey, don't talk to me like you know me. I'm not your friend, and I don't need your advice, okay? I've been assigned this mission, Lieutenant. I didn't come here to wait until you feel like working. Listen, asshole. If it was up to me, I'd throw the lot of you in a dumpster and set a match to it. So stop pissing me off. But things are gonna get nasty. Uh, Lieutenant? I'm sorry to disturb you. I have some information on the AX-400 that killed the guy last night. It's been sighted in the Ravendale district. I'm on it. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to wake you. So it wasn't a nightmare? No. No, it wasn't a nightmare. It's still early. You should try to get some more sleep. I'm not tired anymore. You must be starving. You should take a bath, and then we'll go out and find you something to eat. What do you say? Okay. I'll run you a bath. You're pretty like that. You really look like a human now. Thank you. Your bath's ready. 
We have a gun? Since when? When do we have a gun? Oh, so they're hold on, hold on. They're making an What do I do? Are you done yet? Who is a chasing channel? The victim's name was Todd Williams, an unemployed man from Corktown. According to 100, the android Shot. fled the scene and a police search is now in progress. Reporting live for Channel 16 News, I'm Josh Douglas. You had no choice. He would have killed me if you hadn't stopped him. What are we gonna do? We have nowhere to go. And the police are looking for us now. That android yesterday, he gave me an address. He said we could get help there. Could be worth a try. Just a machine. But I feel as if something ties us together. I want you to know no matter what happens, nothing will ever separate us. Finished getting ready. I'll go out and find some food for you, and then we can get going. Get breakfast for us. How? Lieutenant Anderson, Detroit Police. Looking for a female android robbed a store down the road last night. You see anything? What? An android? No. I don't think androids here. Have you seen anyone that looks like this? Fuck. I knew there was something weird about her. She came in last night. She was dressed normal, you know? There was no way I could tell. Is it still here? Yeah, probably. Room 28. Thank you. <sighs> Oh, now I'm playing as a gun. Hey, when did I shoot? You wait in the car. You're going to need me, Lieutenant. I know more about androids than you do. Listen, I'm tired of you talking back to me. You're a machine, so shut the fuck up and do what I say. 
All I want is to accomplish my mission. I'm sorry if that upsets you. you want to see the end of your mission? Stop busting my fucking balls. Not pig. Like, what can you accomplish? Last time you thought the guy escaped from the back door. Well, nah, sucker. He was with it for a long time. Are you okay? When do we shoot Todd? What Carl should have done is call child services. Report it. Report it to. Yeah, report it to. Report it to them and they just come over. That's the end of the video, guys. Thank you for watching.